Then it flies all the way out close to Jupiter. UC Davis geology professor Chin Ju Yin now knows more about the Sutter's Mill meteorite that hit Northern California in the spring of 2012, like the fact that its journey was short, only about 50,000 years since it was knocked off its parent asteroid. There are lots of discoveries, in fact, including some diamonds in there. You may recall the event sparked a hunt for valuable fragments that may hold answers to the origins of our solar system. A scientific gold rush, some called it, in gold rush country that's still taking place, only 60 miles from the UC Davis campus. It's rather unique because they have so much instrumentation here, just devoted pretty much to meteorites and cosmochemistry. Three, two. The last time this type of meteorite was observed hitting Earth was in 1969, the same year man walked on the moon. It was an era when scientific heroes were born, and they've been studying that meteorite ever since. How long will scientists be looking at these samples and looking for more answers? Decades and decades. Yin says it's possible that the scientific hero of tomorrow is on this campus today. Between 200 and 160 million years ago. Preparing to make the kind of discovery scientists dream of from the secrets that are still hidden in these rocks. What I could find or, one, or someone else could find, it could be really wildest guess of anyone's imagination. It could be beyond wildest guess. Kristen Samos for UC Davis.